half breed. She's a good one. Both sides were against me since the day I was born. Born. Hey folks, it's David Monk from Stargazing. Um, I want to send a message out to the homosexuals of the world and others. Um, I'm singing Half Breed and wearing my custom made uh, share jacket um, because next week, as we all know, is a national holiday. Uh, it shares 70th birthday, and I say that with astonishment because how can that be? Uh, share is turning 70. Wow. I've been writing a piece for my own blog, Stargazing, uh, in tandem with uh, Logo's new Now Next. It took two blogs to support uh, an initiative this big, a celebration this big. And um, there are problems I'm encountering, uh, mostly anxiety. I feel a lot of anxiety for Cher because I know how hard turning 70 is for her. She's made no... Uh, no, she's not minced words for the last 30 years uh, talking about her antipathy toward aging. It started around the time she was 40. And uh, I think it's been a struggle for her. And this is a great opportunity for us to uh, return uh, the kindness that she has expressed to the community for so, so long um, in a very simple way. And here's how my line of thinking went. First, I was thinking there is one thing Cher hates more than aging, and that thing, naturally, is Donald Trump. Uh, I never thought I would feel anything like gratitude toward Donald Trump, but when I put those two ideas together, uh, I did, because I realized that her one-woman uh, fuselage of tweets, uh, which is the only known case of a war being fought from a bed, uh, has probably blunted and blurred the anguish of turning 70 when you're Cher which I can relate to as a gay man, can't you? Um, so anyway, in the event that Trump's candidacy uh, should help anyway, help in any way share who I love, um, that might be the only good thing to come from the torture of having to deal with this guy 24 hours a day for the last year. Here's what I want us to do. Let's all go get a card. I recommend that it should be a condolence card or a thank you card. That's sort of really the only two options. And if money is an issue, make her a card, you know? Kick it old school. And uh, in terms of what to write, that's up to you. I can't tell you what to write, though I'm a writer. Uh, but, you know, say whatever, whatever's in your heart. She's been doing that for 50 years. When you address the envelope, it's really, really simple, because I don't fucking remember her address. I haven't been there since 1999. But here's what you do. You go like this. Share Malibu. Trust me, the post office has been dealing with the share thing since, like, stamps cost two cents. Get it out by Monday morning, and you'll feel good about yourself, because in the end of the day, at the end of the day, in share we trust, right? You got to turn back towel! Towel! David Monk for Stargazing. Check me out.